What's up guys, welcome back to another video, it's the next day. Uh, I actually filmed two videos last night. Uh, one, obviously, the uh, update on David's car. And at night, all the boys got together, we went for a nighttime cruise. Uh, there were some poles, some sends. Uh, went to Puerto Rico, went to Mexico. We had some good times. This guy did a full send with this fully slam static DG, which looks phenomenal coasting. Um, you'll see a video obviously before this one, maybe after this one, I don't know, but uh, you'll, you'll eventually see it. So today we're gonna grab the ow, <laughs> chemical guys ceramic coating hyper wax, and we're gonna apply it on the spooniest one. So the spooniest one's not too dirty, so I'm not gonna pull it out and wash it. I'm just gonna get a cloth, damp it, just go over the car. And then go with the dry one, and then grab an applicator pad and start going to town. And um, let's see if we get as shiny as the yellow. The yellow with the Sonex polymer, so you guys can see, it's still the sun. Man, what a nice glass finish! Oh man, that's beautiful. So we're gonna get to it, and uh, that's gonna be our Sunday. Anything I would just maybe. Alright, so you're saying four dabs on this? Four dabs right on now. that, yeah. So Kev says four dime dabs. Size. Huh? Dime size. Like what kind of dime? Ten cents. Ten cents? Yeah. Yo, this is like a gel, dude. It is. Like, so. Yeah, not falling. Shit. <laughs> okay. That's good. Alright guys, so got this. Guys gonna try to press it out on that. Just dab said, it around like that. So I have to go like this, he said. No circular motion. Yeah, just not like that. No, he said it's three. Well oh, I just one, one, one. Yeah, that's good. You gotta go small sections at a time, right? Yeah, I would. You can go the whole hood. Or trunk. Is it still on it? Yeah. And you just do it off and then you can see the difference. Alright guys, so I did one section. Uh, looking good. So we're going to tackle it right now. This is all going to be in a time lapse. Uh, put a crazy beat in the background. And then uh, we'll do a comparison. So, let's get to it.
so Kevin's been tackling the passenger side as you guys have been seeing I've been tackling the driver's side the roof's done the pillar quarters trunk back door front door and bottom half of the fender and you guys can already I don't know if you guys can see on camera but it's got like a very nice glass finish to it it's very smooth looks phenomenal it's getting there it's getting there you know I still do the back of the trunk and the the back of the bumper and now I'm going to tackle the mirrors fenders hood and front bumper <laughs> yep you scrub baby <laughs> All right, guys, we're done. It looks phenomenal. I'm gonna bring both cars outside and uh, put them next to each other. We're gonna compare. Uh, don't mind my daughter; she's just talking. <laughs> um, we're gonna compare both finishes: the Sonax uh, Polymer and the Chemical Guys um, Ceramic Coating Wax, and uh, we're gonna go from there. So, as you guys can see, man, I'm sweating like crazy so hot out oh yeah the one thing i forgot to do was the visor thanks kev did you do that side no i didn't i didn't do the visor at all but uh 
Like it, it literally gave a glass finish. Like that's the EL. It's shining very nice. That's Kev's escape. He did it on the escape, and like that's that's amazing. And then you got the ES1. All right, guys. So this is the EL, all shiny. After the polymer that we did last night, David and I, and as you guys can see, the finish is amazing. Like, the car looks phenomenal. It brought back the dull silver a lot better than I thought it would be. And now, we use the chemical guys, ceramic coating wax on the spooniest one. And like, just look on the carbon. Like the weave is just so shiny. The pearl white is standing out. I could have done it on the on the uh, RPF ones, but I chose not to. But it looks phenomenal. It came out amazing. I'm in love. So, guys, let me know which one you think did a better job. The Sonax or the um, Chemical Guys. Let me know in the comments below. Um, both cars are just like radiant right now. Fantastic. Couldn't be happier. This is a sick shot still. All right, guys, I'm gonna sign off from this one. Uh, thank you for tuning in. I know it was more of a time-lapse video. But uh, it's something I wanted to do and uh, see if I could revitalize the color on both cars. Um, so uh, I'm really happy with the end result. I'm looking at it. It's phenomenal. It's just a shame that we have no events to go to this year. Uh, but Grash Xene on the 25th is holding a K-Series meet. So at least I get with some uh, fellow car enthusiasts and just hang out and vibe. So that's going to do it for today's vlog. Guys, thank you for tuning in. Uh, like always, like, comment, subscribe. Oh shit, that sun's right in the eyes. And um, until the next one, peace out. Just send it.